it up at night We can pour out the wine I got cash on my mind Yeah, I don't really mind And I don't have the time Every day I go out Every day a new route That you know nothing about, no Why always me? Ooh, oh, like I'm Balu Deli Ooh, oh, why always me? Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to create this look using the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette. But the first thing I always do is primer my eyelids and I use the Smashbox Photo Finish Lid Primer. Before using this, I always use the MAC Soft Ochre, but I feel like this has more of a soft texture and doesn't dry out my eyelids. And I blend this in using my Beauty Blender and then I'm going to softly set this with a little bit of translucent powder to keep it in place. So now I'm using the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette and I'm starting with this soft brown shade. I'm just going to blend this in my crease all over, just going from the inner corner to the outer corner. And the brush that I'm using is by the brand Makeup Addiction. Not sure if they still sell it, but I believe it comes in their ultimate eye kit. And it's really soft, really nice to use. Now I'm going in with the shade Puder. And I'm going to do the exact same thing as I did with the other eyeshadow shade. I'm just going to blend this all over in my crease using that same brush. And just blend this back and forth. So nothing really special. <laughs> but yeah, this is definitely one of my current favorite blending brushes. Besides the Morphe M504. So now I'm going in with the shade Buns. And I'm going to blend this in my crease as well. It's a lot darker, so I first kind of try to not apply too much product on my brush but softly build it up and I'm really focusing in my crease so not going like very wild all over the place but I'm really trying to focus a little bit more in my crease so now I picked up a more flat blending brush because I felt like that worked a little bit better so now I'm going in with the shade Mocha and I'm going to blend this in my crease as well. First, when I created this look, I wanted to go for a cut crease. So instead of doing this with a super tiny brush as I'm doing right now, I would prefer to use like the brush from Makeup Addiction. But yeah, I'm just trying to darken up my crease. So now for all my eyelid, I'm going to use the shade Beam. And I'm first going to press this in my inner corner. And then I'm making my brush wet to give it a little bit more intensity. I feel with this palette, um, the shades look so much better when you make your brush wet. Um, I feel like this is always with shimmery metallic shades. But yeah, I just wanted to make the eyeshadow shades pop as much as possible. So that's why I made my brush wet. So now I'm going in with the shade Queen. And same story, I made my brush wet while I was applying this. Well, not while I was applying this, but before I applied this. To give it extra intensity, and the brush that I'm using is the MAC 2 for 2, my favorite one. I have two brushes of these because it's just my favorite brush, so I needed to have a backup brush for whenever I lose one of them. But yeah, it's so nice to apply shades with on the eyelid. So now I'm going in with the shade Roxana, Roxanne, <laughs> and I'm using a flat blending brush again, and I'm just going to press this in my outer V. And at the same time, I'm also going to blend this a little bit towards my crease. So the shade kind of blends with the shades in my crease. And it will just make everything melt perfectly into each other. And I really like this eyeshadow shade. It's super warm. It's just like one of my favorite shades when it comes to eyeshadows. So now I switch my brush into the Makeup Addiction brush. And I'm just going to blend around my crease. To make sure that everything melts together and that the, eye, the eyeshadow shades that I applied on my eyelid aren't looking too harsh on the eyelid but it just melts together. So now I'm going in with this rose gold glitter by the brand Certify and to apply this I'm using my MAC Mixing Medium Gel. So first I apply a tiny layer of the MAC Mixing Medium Gel on the eyelid. Then I dab my brush into the glitter and I'm going to softly dab this on the eyelid. And I feel like the MAC Mixing Medium Gel dries pretty quickly, so sometimes I need to go back in with my brush into the MAC Mixing Medium Gel and apply a bit more of that product. So now I'm going in with this black eyeliner from the brand Beauty Bakery. And yeah, I don't really know. It was the first time trying this eyeliner and I'm not sure if you can see it, but it applies a little bit sheer. So I went on top of this 
with my NVC liquid liner. I did this off camera, but you can really see while applying it, it just looks a little bit sheer. And I did apply a generous amount, so I don't know, I'm not going to use this eyeliner again. But now I'm going in with some concealer and I'm going to apply this right underneath my wing to make it look extra sharp. Now for my waterline, I'm going to use the Marc Jacobs Highliner Pencil in the shade Blacker. Blacker. And I'm just going to apply this in the waterline and also um, tight line my upper lashes to make it look extra smoky. So now I'm going in with the black shade from the Morphe palette. And I'm using a super tiny brush which is by Zuiva. This, this came in in a limited edition kit but I'm sure they also sell it separately. It's really nice and precise and just pressing that black eyeshadow underneath my lower lash line. So now I'm going in with the shade Roxanne and I'm going to apply this underneath the black eyeshadow and a little bit on top of it. So it kind of blends together if that makes sense. So now I'm using my Dose of Colors pencil brush and I'm just going to blend everything out so it looks super nice and smoky. So today I tried out this new Max Factor mascara. Well, I'm not really sure if it's a new one, but I got it new in the mail. And it's quite a big brush, um, but it did make my upper lashes and lower lashes look super long, which I really like. Um, I just wish that the brush would be a little bit more smaller, but that's fine. Um, so far I really like it. So now I applied some lashes off camera and I'm wearing the style Sassy for my own lash company, Anytude. I will put a link down in the description bar where you can get them. Um, tomorrow or Thursday all my lashes will be back in stock. And if you want me to make a video where I show the whole lash collection, let me know in the comments. And yeah, I hope to see you in my next video. I really hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy and I hope to see you next time. Bye guys! I've been out here on my own I've been out, I've been grinding all alone Yeah Get up at night We can pour out the wine I got cash on my mind Yeah, I don't really mind And I don't have the time Every day I go out Every day a new route That you know nothing